大家好，欢迎收看今天的成长汉语。Welcome to today's episode of Growing Up with Chinese. 今天星期几 ？Yes, I just asked you what day of the week it is. Although I bet your answers are all different because depending on where you live in the world, it could be yesterday, today, or tomorrow. So a better question would be, 现在几点 ？What time is it? And of course, it's time for us to begin. Now today's content is quite relaxing because it falls under the topic of leisure time, and it's so nice when you have time to do things that you might not normally get to do, like read a book, play a video game, sleep in, or whatever else might relax you. Now today, Xiao Ming and Mike are looking at a nice chunk of leisure time, but what will they do with it? Let's check it out. Mom，麦克怎么还睡呢？该起床了。你别吵，今天周末了，让他多睡一会儿吧。啊，还睡？您看，都快十点了，他还有时差呢。你先吃早饭吧，好吧？好吧。妈，我下楼打会儿球。你去吧，我早点回来。嗯、hmm, ，Mike never appeared today, and Xiaoming looked a little antsy. Well, I guess the two of them just have different preferences for what they do during their free time. Let's take a look at today's dialogue, shall we? And see exactly what's going on. Mike 怎么还睡呢 ？How is Mike still sleeping? Or Mike still sleeping? The key to this sentence is in the 怎么 and 还 We'll expand on these two in just a few minutes. Now the second part of Xiaoming's exclamation is 很晚了，该起床了 It's very late. He ought to be up. Xiaoming, 起床了。妈 ，Mike 怎么还睡呢？该起床了。And Xiao Ming's mom replies by saying, "Let him sleep a little bit longer." Notice the ba here at the end of the sentence. Let him sleep a little bit longer. Notice the ba here at the end of the sentence. She's suggesting they let Mike sleep a little bit longer. He has a time difference. He's still jet lagged. Time difference is the term for jet lag or time difference. If someone has time difference or has time difference. It's referring to jet lag. Shh! Don't argue. Today is Friday. Let him sleep a little longer. Ah, still sleeping. Look, it's almost ten o'clock. He has a time difference. You eat your lunch first. Okay. Okay. 妈，我下楼打会儿球。你去吧，早点回来。